Hey guys! Alright, so welcome back to my channel. My name is Zach, as you know, and today we're gonna try another Amberlynn Reed recipe! Y'all, have you missed it? Have you missed it? So, you might have recalled, like, a week or two ago, she posted... Um, some like heinous, well not heinous, it was like a tuna like mashup, like maybe supposed to be tuna salad, but also not tuna salad. And I made the mistake of posting a comment, please, nobody like it. And then I got like over 900 likes on it on her YouTube. I'll post a little screenshot here because uh, sometimes y'all try to say that nobody, and by y'all I mean like the haters. <laughs> try to say that like nobody requested these things it's like no y'all did request these things and just saying so we're gonna make that today I'm a little bit nervous because literally almost every ingredient in it is something that I hate and so I'm doing this for you all you know I'm being a brave warrior queen slay the house down boots all of those things just for you all just trying this um, it's a bit of a struggle because literally when she got done with it, it looked like dog food to me. And I'm like, how is, how is this a thing? But we're gonna try it. And it's my lunch break today. Like I'm literally coming to you at lunch to make this video. So for all of you that say I don't have a life and that I must not have anything else to do, I'm literally taking time out of my lunch break to make this video and eat this for my lunch today. So let's get started. All right y'all, so here are the ingredients. We got some olives now listen i hate olives i'm not even sure if these were the kind of olives that she used this was just the cheapest option because i'm literally not going to eat any of these after today i think i'm even going to try to like dice them up somewhat small because of all the things like i can tough it through everything else but olives are like one of, i've just never liked olives like zero parts of me so olives we have some banana pepper rings. I think she called them something else in her video, but I think I'll probably be okay with this. My only concern is that these are like pickled and I don't tend to like pickled anything, but peppers in general are not something I hate. So there's that. I also got this Star Kiss Chunk Tuna Light. I think this is exactly what she had, except with maybe the exception of, I don't know if hers had sunflower oil in it. We also got mayonnaise, which I don't mind, but she only put like a tablespoon in it. And I think like usually when you make some kind of like tuna salad, it's more. She referred to these as everything bagels. I think she might have had some that were like everything bagel flavored or something, but she definitely in her video called it everything bagel. I just could find the original. So that's what we're going with today. Now, one of her great tips is just use salty things and you don't have to use salt so we're not using salt but i will add a little bit of black pepper in there and i have a big gulp of diet coke because you know your girl your girl is you know using drinking lots of water but sometimes it's okay to have a diet coke it's a diet soda is okay if i was really doing this right i would have gotten sprite zero but <laughs> i don't like sprite so we're having a diet coke because your girl needs her caffeine today i'm gonna mix it up we're gonna get started and then after i mix it up because this is not even really like cooking this is really just like throwing things together and mixing them up um so after that then you can come join me and eat it and see what i think all right so we're gonna get started and i'm gonna put in just like a tablespoon of mayo. I'll put a little tiny bit more in because I just feel like it's gonna need a little bit more than that. But I don't wanna go, I wanna stray too far from the recipe, you know? So I'm gonna try to keep it around the same. So I did slice up some of the, that's not in frame at all, <laughs> the olives. Ooh, and the juice is running down. Um, the olives and the peppers. Now, I was thinking about it, and, like, tuna salads, they do usually have, like, like, I know my family always made it with pickles in it. It was one of my least favorite parts of it, too. So, like, the pickled flavor with the, like, peppers is probably not that weird. The olives are going to be a lot for me, though. Not going to lie. Not going to lie. And then I haven't even picked this up, but it's 150 calories. We're just going to toss the whole thing in there. Oh, God, I hate tuna so much. I can't remember if I said that just moments ago. But I literally, I hate it. It smells bad. I just don't like really anything <laughs> about it. 
And this is not gonna make nearly as much as I would hope, so I hope I'm not like hungry. Let's see, let's add the pepper. This is like not a lot at all. She did have this as a snack though, so I should have probably thought about that. This should probably not be my full meal, but we're just gonna mix it up. Ooh, that's like a lot of mayonnaise. Maybe I really should have just, I mean, I didn't put that much more. Oh my God, this does not look appetizing at all. I'm already like dreading eating this. Y'all, if I die, please somebody take over my YouTube channel. I, I'm gonna will it to oh hamburgers in the comments. If I die, you can have my YouTube channel. It's all yours. Okay, that is something. <laughs> oh, do y'all see this? Do y'all see this? All right, well, I'm gonna have some of this. Actually, I'm probably gonna stage some kind of photo. Actually, let's just do that now. Also, do y'all see my grok pot in the background? I just leave that on my counter. Why not? But let's see, let's open this up. Ooh, does it look, does it look professionally staged just like Amber Lynn would do? <laughs> All right, I'm gonna take you over. We're gonna eat. It's gonna be cute, hopefully. I don't know. <laughs> Stay tuned. Okay, everybody, so we're back. And here, here it is. Oh, this is just like, why do I do this? I do this because I love YouTube. This is for y'all. <laughs> I don't think you all realize, I feel like if you like tuna, I mean a lot of people said on the comments of my comment on Amberlynn's videos like, oh that's not that different from like tuna salad and y'all probably right, I just really hate like 90% of the ingredients in here. I can't, I can't, I can't even, I'm struggling with even scooping it on. Okay, alright, here it goes. Pray for me. Just send, just take a moment to pause your video and send a little prayer up. Send a little prayer up. You know, Amberlynn did just go to church, so let's send a prayer up. Okay, all right. Okay. Okay, I will admit, it could be worse. It could be worse. I think like 90% of that was just getting over the hurdle. Just getting over the hurdle. It's, it's not that bad. I don't know if I had any olive in that. I will say, this is salty AF. So, like real salty. Surprisingly, like, I don't know that I can even taste the olive. If nothing else, it's just like salty. Y'all, I'm gonna say, I think you were right in the comments. This could be worse. I mean, it definitely doesn't look like appetizing at all. But it could, it could definitely be worse. Look, I think I'm gonna eat this for lunch. I don't know. You know, you let me know in the comments, like, do you think this looks nasty? Would you eat it? Oh man. I haven't stopped, so I'm just like a little shook right now. Like, I didn't throw up. I mean, ugh. It just looks like barf. It looks like cat barf. 
like wasabi or rarity came over here and just threw up. But, you know, you get past that appearance and it's just like really salty mayonnaise, really. Like, I can't even super, super taste the, um, well, no, I can definitely taste the tuna. I feel like I'm also tasting a lot of, like, the juice from the pepper rings. But, like, there's definitely, like, a pickled taste in here. I guess I'm tasting a little bit of the, that bad I tasted a little bit of the, um, ooh, words, the peppers. But, yeah, guys, words are hard. But look at that. Like, do y'all want, do y'all want a bite? No? Yes? No? <laughs> okay, y'all. Listen, we made it. I'm like four pretzel chips in and I haven't died, so I guess I'm gonna stick with this for my lunch. Honestly, I'm also doing this for my lunch because I needed to go grocery shopping and I didn't and this is all I had left and I've been kind of putting this video off. Or that was a big chunk of tuna. But yeah, I've been putting it off because, like, you could tell, like, by just how badly I didn't want to take that first bite. And I'm like, this is going to be so gross. I don't want to do it. Don't make me do it. It says, this one has a lot of olives, so I'm curious if I'm going to taste the olive in it. Mm-mm. I don't know, maybe I just forgot what olives taste like, but I like thought I hated them, like was repulsed by them. You know, I don't know what I would do without Diet Coke. I don't have any refillable water bottles though, otherwise I would have drank some of that. Delicious, y'all. Wow. Oh, mmm. Yeah, it had a lot of the pickle flavor. It's so salty. I feel like everything else I've ever had by her, I've said, this food is bland, it's not great, but this is just like overwhelmingly salty. Like, no wonder girl is retaining so much water. Like, all the water weight from all the salt and the sodium. Like, Anything else she gets low sodium. This, everything is like salty AF. Like, woo, girl, calm down. Yeah, like, thank God you didn't add more salt to it because that would be ridiculous. This is so salty. And I feel like that was the critique people had is like, oh, you're, you're so great. Like, here's a great dieting tip. Don't put salt in. Just replace it with a bunch of other really salty things. This is overwhelmingly salty. It probably doesn't help that this... That these have like salt on them too. Everything is just salty. That I think is really all I got. I know that this was like a little less in depth than some of the other. <coughs> ooh, ooh, I think I think an olive was stuck in my throat. I think this is a little less in depth than the other cook with me Amberlynn read recipe things. But you know, there's more to come. You can continue giving me suggestions of things to like. You know, I've seen kimchi fried rice. I've seen the chocolate gravy. So, if anything else comes up, just let me know that you want to see it. You can tweet at me. I always have my Twitter and Instagram in the description of my video. So, feel free to follow me on those social media platforms. And just keep me posted. I am having so much fun making videos for you all. I hope you enjoyed it too. Please make sure to subscribe, hit the bell notification, hit the like button. If you want, hit the dislike button, uh, leave me some comments, and I will see you all next time. Bye!